I just wanted to share my August favorite with you guys. So if you like to see the products that I loved or enjoy using so much that I thought I can share them with you, please continue watching. I'm starting with something a bit random and these this is the Kitty's Care, Kitty Care Naturally Clean Fragrance Free Wipes. Yes, it's baby wipes. Now, I was using up some of my makeup wipes for swatches and I felt okay, I needed to get something for swatches, even lip swatches and that kind of stuff. So, went into my local beauty, one of my local beauty supply stores called Pennywise, here in Trinidad, and I more or less didn't want, I was just looking for something really, really expensive. This is like two US dollars or what was out to about two US dollars and I was really happy with my find and I picked it up. I have a review of this on my Sweet RV channel because that's more like a vlog channel, everyday kind of channel so I put it there. But this is really awesome, I like it. It's perfect for swatches and even sometimes I take, use it to take off makeup. I like that it just works and I enjoy it and I thought I'll share it with you all. In addition to the wipes, I have been loving this Caramere Moisturizer and it can almost double up as a face primer. It's really, really nice and it just moisturizes your face but it does not make your face feel too oily or greasy. I really like that your face feels, feels smooth and if you actually put this on at night when you wake up in the morning, your face really feels smooth and nice. So definitely recommend this. Have a review up on this product already and definitely recommend you guys another product I'm loving and I do have a review on this product and this is the NYX mineral set it and don't fret it matte finishing powder and this I have here is in medium dark I love it I am wearing it it's really nice for setting your makeup without looking all kiki and all that kind of stuff so this is another recommendation not a review on this product I do have up but yeah I was loving it for August have not done a review on this product and this is the Origins Original Skin Renewal Serum with Willow Herb and I absolutely love this. I have to read up more about it but it's a serum applied both morning and evening. My face feels ultra smooth with it. It feels a lot like a primer. When I put it on I literally can see um, like my makeup glides on on it too but I use this at night and I use the caramel during the day. And I absolutely love this and I'm going to do some more research to see like you know what the benefits are. I did throw with the little packaging that it did come with but I'm definitely going to check it out and then do a review on this product. I'm actually considering getting a full size of it. Last face product is this Caramia blush in four. I do have reviews again on this blush so but it's gorgeous. It's a beautiful everyday blush that just looks so natural I am wearing it very easy to apply gorgeous everyday color and for those of you who have the season fall that's coming in this is like so perfect for fall and you could even they have so pigmented that you could even use them as eyeshadow so if you have not checked out the Caramere brand definitely recommend if you have this brand in your anywhere around you definitely grab it because it's amazing and the color that I recommend is fawn moving on to eyes I have another Caramere product here and this is one of their eyeshadow trios. This one is in Grapevine. Very unique color combination but I really liked it and enjoyed using it so much. Got a lot of compliments when I actually did use this. I would use this as my lid color, this in the crease and that as my brow bone and even in a tear dots. Beautiful, beautiful um, and super pigmented eyeshadows. That's them there swatch pink and gray generally look looks beautiful together if you haven't paired them together definitely recommend you to try it and let me know what your thoughts are next is another eye is an eyeshadow palette and this one is from LA colors and this is in Beverly Hills I absolutely love this I think hands down this is one of the most pigmented palettes that I have used in quite a while pigmentation is so on point for how inexpensive this palette is it's about five US dollars and oh gorgeous see and it has the right set of colors to me the only thing I would say it misses like rusty colors a couple of rusty colors or even like a orange but other than that perfect I don't usually like um, like a dark black 
and gray, those gray tones are not usually my fan. I love greens, blues, pinks, purples. They're all here. This palette does not have a highlight in color, but that's okay because I already have so many others. I have a review on this palette, and I plan to do maybe a Get Ready With Me on my Rowana, uh, Get Ready With Row channel. So look out for that, but gorgeous. And um, let me just give you a couple little swatches. That's uh, three colors, yes, it, it's dark pigmented. That's it. If you want to see more swatches of this palette, I have a review. I'll try and link everything I have review in the description box. So if you have not watched it, you can definitely jump to it. So, three colors. Jumping into lip products, I am so surprised that I actually enjoyed this lip liner. This is from L'Oreal Color Riche, and it is in Beyond Pink. That's the color of Bela yeah. Beyond Pink, and it's a pale pinky nude color. But I was so shocked that I enjoyed it. I will put this on first and then I will put my MAC I Love Winter on top and it looks like a perfect nude. I have I did use it in a couple of videos, got lots of compliments. They just look it looks so natural. It makes it just makes any look look really put together and beautiful. I totally enjoyed this lip gloss. I pulled it out recently as I was digging through my collection looking for things that I haven't used and this is the Avon Glaze Wear um, lip gloss and this one I think is in mauve. This is so gorgeous. This is like your lips but better and it works really great on top of that lip liner or almost by itself. I've used this a couple times by itself and just out the door it just looks like your lips when you use it just like that without any lip pencil it looks like your lips but better but on top of any um new lip liner it just looks perfect if you use it with a pink it tones down the pink and you see more of the more pulling through and if you use this on top of let's say for example a purple lip liner it just mutes it but it looks amazing and i definitely love this and so happy i pulled this out Next we have these and I, this would not be this month's favorite if I didn't talk about these Profusion Matte Lip Gloss Duos. So it's a matte lipstick and a matte lip gloss. I have reviews on my on the same channel already with it so I'm not going to really do swatches because they do stain their matte glosses. So these matte glosses do apply matte. I am wearing the red which is number one. And they apply, they take less than a minute they take more than 30 seconds to dry but they take about a minute to dry and once they're there they don't budge do not feel tight on the lips and they do come off um, they're a little less stubborn than most liquid lipsticks so I like that but they do have a good wear time with them so that makes it amazing the lipsticks though on the other hand it says matte lipsticks some of them are more like a creamy matte formula but I like them because most of them hold to their pigmentation especially like this red here it is I mean it's like really pigmented and it have a yummy scent too but they hold they sit so well on the lips and they apply so amazing and they wear pretty good time if you put it on a lip pencil do you get the best payoff in that it actually had a little moisture in it goes applies uh, most lip pencils are matte and when you put the creamy matte on top of it, it makes that lip pencil really comfortable to wear. Adds a little moisture to it so it's not dry and it makes your, leg fe your lips <laughs> feel like it's going to be flaky and cracky. Um, so I absolutely love these. I have four. Number four and ten are my favorite. That's these two. I absolutely love number 10 though, which is this one here, but they're just so gorgeous. And this red, I keep getting lots and lots of compliments every time I wear it, but I definitely love them and definitely would recommend you guys to try them out. Last product that I'm going to talk about is this L'Oreal Advanced Hair Care. It's their Total Repair Extreme Split End Fixer. It repairs broken fibers and it mends split ends. I actually did trim my hair but some of them, I think some of my strands still had some, well they were still split and I started using this almost I think for close to two months now and I have seen a change in like just the feel of my hair. I can't say it totally if it mended all my split ends because I'm not really seeing split ends now and I've gone to the beach like quite a lot of times um, from since my sister was ever within the last month or two. 
and I can say that usually with going to the beach so many times I will have horrible split ends. I am not. I use this every time I come out of the shower while I wash my hair I put I run this through and I've been using it for about a month and I still have it. I paid fifty TT dollars, which is like about eight US dollars, but I will so repurchase this because it keep, it is helping to keep my hair hair follicles not hair follicles, my hair strand pretty healthy and I'm totally enjoying it. I can't say it fix my split ends, but definitely can see that it is working to keep my hair strand strong and it does not break as easily as how it was before. So kudos to this, two thumbs up, love it, would repurchase this when it actually finishes. So there we have it for my August 2015 favorites. I know it was maybe a little random um, in terms of all the stuff I was sharing. I do plan to do like um, some random favorites on my vlog channel which is Sweet RV so you should see it uploaded in a couple days after this one. But I totally have been enjoying these products and I thought I'll share it with you. Most of them I have reviews on just because I really wanted to get how good these products were out to you guys. So I hope you enjoy it. Thank you so much for your time in watching this video. If you like a lot of these products, go ahead and thumbs up. If you like favorites, go ahead and thumbs up this video. And it will make my day. And I love hearing what you guys enjoyed for the month of August also. So leave those in comments section below. I love hearing from you. And I will definitely be replying and checking out your responses. So until next time, bye.